itsy bitsy spider plunked up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Out came the sun and dried up all the rain. And the itsy bitsy spider climbed up the spout again. The itsy bitsy spider climbed down to Phoebe's head. She screams and she yells, but it was just her. Si araña subió por la pared, vino la lluvia y se la llevó. Ya salió el sol, se secó la lluvia y si bien si araña otra vez subió. Y si bien si araña bajó por su cabeza, ella gritó y se asustó. Es su amigo Groovy que quiere jugar. Vivi se relaja y le pide perdón. Itchy Bitchy Araña subió por su papá. El papá gritó y mucho se asustó. Le persigue con una manguera por todo el jardín. Pero Vivi grita, Groovy se transformó. Tiens, voilà la pluie, Gypsy tombe par terre Mais le soleil a chassé la pluie La reine et Gypsy grimpe sur la gouttière La reine et Gypsy grimpe sur la gouttière Tiens, voilà la pluie, Gypsy tombe par terre Mais le soleil a chassé Gypsy grimpe sur la gouttière La reine Gypsy grimpe sur la gouttière Tiens, voilà la pluie, Gypsy tombe par terre Mais le soleil a chassé la pluie La reine Gypsy grimpe sur la gouttière <rire> Noises. I'm a little scared of monsters. I know they don't exist, but I'm still kind of scared. Well, I'm not afraid of anything, much less monsters, since we all know they don't exist. But I've seen some really strange things and heard some really strange noises that I have no idea how to explain. Just because you can't explain where the noises are coming from doesn't mean that they're hidden monsters. Well, maybe you're right. And all the noises I'm hearing are... Ah! Ah! I'm sure that was just the wind. The wind doesn't make that kind of sound. It came from that bush there. Oh, don't be silly, Moo Moo. You'll see that it was nothing. I'm going to hit it with this stick so you'll uh, see there's nothing there. Mm. Let's go, Rita. It's nothing. It's just a... Where have you been? 
again. Oh, where am I? Let's try that. Let's try that. Let's try that. When the monster and he's in, and when you give him one and and then. What was that horrifying noise? There's a monster in the bushes. Ah! Monsters don't exist. There must be a logical explanation for this. There are no monsters. When we find out what it is, we'll have a good laugh. <gasps> Moo Moo, tell me exactly what happened. Well, Rita and I were walking peacefully along the dirt road. We were just minding our own business, talking about important matters. And all of a sudden, we heard a loud roar. First, we thought it was Rita's belly. But then, thanks to my intelligence, I deduced that there was a monster hidden in the bushes. Rita took a stick to battle against it. But then she screamed again, and we both ran away. We've got to go and investigate that noise. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? There's a monster. Don't go there. Yes, it's horrible. You can't just go. <sighs> They've left us all alone. Uh, how about we go with them? No! There's a monster! Oh! The monster's hiding behind that bush! What do you think it could be? I already know it can't be a monster, but I'm still scared. Don't you worry. There must be a logical explanation. He's going to devour us all! Run! <laughs> That sound is coming from some sort of huge beast. At the very least, it's a wild lion. A uh, lion? Oh, lions like to eat giraffe meat. I don't want to be his snack. Bye-bye. Uh, that lion's going to eat all of us. I think that we better get out of here right away before it's too late. Milo. We better go home because that lion could devour us in one bite. Yes, Olga, we better go. I'm not scared or anything, but I'd rather go home for a snack. Yes, yes, a snack sounds like a good idea. Moo Moo, Rita, we're going. Want to come? And so what are we going to do about the lion? We leave him here. We don't want to end up being his meal. Yeah, yeah, let's get out of here. No! Talalo, no! don't do it! If you mess with the lion, don't he's do going to no. take revenge on us! <laughs> it's Alfred! He really scared all of us! I knew it couldn't be a monster, because monsters don't really exist! So then... Alfred is a lion? <laughs> <laughs> Why is everyone staring at me? Can't anyone sleep in peace around here? Sleep? Yes. But you were snoring like a wild animal. We thought you were a lion. Excuse me, but Sir Alfred doesn't snore. He breathes with style. Excuse me, but Sir Alfred doesn't snore. He roars. Rawr! So then, Rita is also a lion? <laughs> we all got a bit scared. I knew it couldn't be a monster because they don't exist, but I still got scared. And I was also scared, but just a little bit. Well, I wasn't scared at all. I knew right away it was Alfred snoring. You're a bunch of scaredy cats. Ah! A lion! A vicious lion that's going to devour us all! You know what? Yesterday I saw a really ugly fly that wouldn't stop bothering me. Olga, every fly is ugly and they also smell bad. How did 
disgusting. A big fly with hair all over the place. I don't know what they're good for. All they do is bother you. Well, just like you, Rita. You're like a fly. You do nothing but bother us all the time. Me? That's not true at all. Uh, 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 uh. You are a stinky fly. And you're like a green booger. That's so gross! A green and stinky booger? Quit biting, you two. You're like two flies that do nothing but fly around and fight. But she's the one who started it. No, you're the one who started it. Hi there. Why are those two fighting? Ah! A spider! Somebody help me! Ah! Where's the spider? Spiders gross me out. Go away, bug! <laughs> I just wanted to say, yeah, yeah, whatever you say, but just go somewhere else. Okay, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Go far away, dear. Real far away. Make sure we can't see you. Did you see how hairy and ugly she was? I don't know if she was ugly or not, but I'm really scared of spiders. She was really ugly, and we don't want her around us. Hi, what were those screams that I heard? There was a spider right there, and it scared us half to death. It scared you? <laughs> Spiders are harmless. They only attack when they feel threatened, just like bees do. Whatever you say, but it was a red, ugly spider. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Red and ugly? I hope you don't mean little spider. Who is little spider? Little spider is my friend. She's a really nice and funny spider. I hope you weren't mean to her. She's a very good friend of mine. Oh, uh, yeah, but we didn't know she was your friend. But it's a... Uh, a hairy spider. I can't believe it. You cannot judge anyone before you get to know them. I'm going to look for her, and when I find her, you should apologize. Oh, dear. We really were mean to Little Spider. Yeah. If I had known she was Milo's friend, I wouldn't have been so mean to her. It still makes my skin crawl, but I'm going to try to talk to her. Little Spider! Little Spider! Where are you? Don't pay attention to what my friend said to you. You're my friend, and I want you to come with me. My friends said they want to apologize to you. Little spider, don't hide. Let me explain. I never want to see your friends again. They were all really mean to me. Little spider, I'm so sorry, but my friends are really nice. It's just that they're afraid of, of things they don't understand. But I told them you're my friend, and from now on, they're going to be nice to you. Are you sure they won't get scared when they see me? I assure you. Come on, climb on my arm and let me introduce you. Here we are. <clears throat> <clears throat> Little spider, I'm very sorry for what we said to you before. I just got scared. Will you forgive me? Of course I forgive you. I know that you're good friends of Milo's, and he told me that you're nice to all the other animals. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry for the mean things I said to you. I hope you'll forgive me. Yeah, I feel the same as Mimo. End of story. I forgive all of you. You see, little spider? Now you have some new friends. Well, now that we're friends, I'm going to tell you a joke. A joke? A spider telling a joke? I can't believe it. Mm -hmm. Rita! What is red and dangerous? Strawberry jam with the tarantula. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> that was a good one, little spider. Can you tell us another one? What do you get if you mix a rose with a tarantula? I don't know, but you better not try to smell it. <laughs> Now 
it's my <laughs> turn to tell a joke. <laughs> but you're no good at telling jokes, Moo Moo. What do you mean I'm no good? I am great at telling jokes. I'm sorry, Moo Moo. The truth is that we never understand your jokes because you start laughing before you finish telling them, and then you never finish them. This one you'll understand for sure. It's really good. Why did the chicken cross the road? Mm, I don't know, Moo Moo. To get to the other side. <laughs> it's excellent. <laughs> did you get it, huh? Come on, don't go. I want to tell another one. <laughs>